Cloud Types The system for naming clouds was introduced in 1802 by Luke Howard, a chemist and amateur meteorologist. He gave the clouds Latin names because Latin was the international language used for classifications of the natural world. There are ten main cloud groups. Here are a few. Cirrus clouds. These are very high clouds, usually 6 to 12 kilometers above the ground. They are made of tiny ice crystals and are usually seen as thin wispy fibers. Cumulus clouds. These are white fluffy dome-shaped heats, usually with a flat base and a cauliflower top. They are generally found between 300 and 1,500 meters above the ground. Stratus clouds. These are blanket clouds in a layer that can cover the whole sky, making it overcast. They are found between the ground and 1,000 meters. Sometimes they produce long periods of drizzle. In Scotland, we use the word drift to describe these clouds. There are two more special clouds that are linked to bad weather and rainy days. The first of these is Nimbostratus, from Nimbus, the Latin word for rain cloud, hence layers of rain clouds. These are found between the surface and three kilometers up. These clouds cause moderate to heavy rain or snow. The second of these is Cumulonimbus. These are huge towering clouds in the shape of a blacksmith's anvil. Thunderstorms are large Cumulonimbus clouds and bring heavy showers or hail in winter. They can stretch upwards from 600 metres to 8 kilometres. Understanding cloud type can help us forecast the weather.